Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, back again with another video. And today I'm going to be filming, I don't, I don't really know. I just wanted to show you guys a few brushes that I have gotten from AliExpress. One thing that I will say about AliExpress is I don't really recommend buying makeup from AliExpress. Like if you're buying makeup from AliExpress, that's at your own risk because you don't really know yeah they're really good dupes for a lot of these palettes but you don't know the ingredients that's in that makeup so i don't know i wouldn't really purchase makeup from aliexpress i have bought glitter though like jars of little glitter and these these were good but one thing that i would recommend would be their brushes so i have bought a lot of brushes from aliexpress recently I've ordered these brushes before and they're still keeping up like I still use some of them to this day and they haven't fallen apart I, I just wanted to show you guys because every time I find something that I like that's affordable I want to show you guys and that's pretty much why I started this channel in the first place I want to share with you guys what I find and just you know help each other out because this is a find this is a find I'm gonna show you guys the different brushes that I got, the different brush sets that I recommend, and yeah, we're just gonna go from there. So yeah, let's just get right into it. So I did get two different brush sets, and then just like a single brush. All the brushes that I got, all the sellers, all the direct links will be in the description box, so just make sure to open that if you wanna go to the direct link. So let's just start off with this one. So. It was in a little like package but i took it out um this is the first brush this looks so similar to the nars brush i don't really know how to pronounce the nars brush it's like yayi something yachio 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 brush and it's really soft um it was a dollar like 150 and it looks exactly like the brush the i went to sephora to try and look at it it looks exactly like the brush even like the number right here that says 27 the hair feels the same uh i would use this to maybe like bronze up the face like, i haven't tried this one out before so um, I feel like doing a little like chit chat get ready with me after this video just to like test the brushes out this one especially because I'm really excited for this one I know NARS has one and then Japanesque has another one that looks similar to this one so yeah I'm excited to try this out it was 150 out of all the brushes this one came the latest I think this one took about like three weeks to come in the other brushes came pretty quick like i was surprised because aliexpress their sellers are mainly from china so it does take a while for the stuff to come in this one took the longest yeah i'm not it hasn't shed like when i when i touch it it hasn't shed so yeah, I'm excited to try this out. And on my Snapchat or in future videos, I will update you guys if I keep liking the brushes. One of the brush sets I'm already familiar with, and it's the this one, the Jessup brushes. So Jessup is a really good brand. I bought, I would, I, I would say I would bought a Jessup set like probably two years ago when I was really, really like starting out with makeup and i still use some of those brushes today for example you guys always see me use this lip brush in my tutorials for like the concealer to cut my crease and it's still holding up pretty well um the bottom is like metal and i just take it off and then this one this jessup duo fiber powder brush i always like this is my favorite brush to bronze with and hasn't fallen off the the hair hasn't shed like it's really good this is the flat definer i use this on my lower lash sometimes and i just feel like they're really good like they've kept up with me all this time so i decided to buy a new set from aliexpress so this one was the priciest one but i did get a lot of brushes so this one is the 15 piece pearl rose gold um brush set this one was about $13. I first ordered my first Jessup brush set. It was like a face and eye set. So I got a lot of face brushes and a lot of eye brushes. These are mostly eye brushes. So the first one that caught my eye was this Jessup 227 
Luxie Soft Definer. This looks exactly like the MAC 217 and the Morphe M433. My brushes are always dirty, but this is the MAC M4, not the MAC, the Morphe M433, and this is the Jessa brush. It's that goat hair, like, the one that I talked about in my last video, it's, it's flat, like, it's precise, but it's fluffy enough to blend your eyeshadow out in your crease. So this one, this is really intriguing me because I didn't get one like this in my last set. So if this works well, girl, 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 like I think this one was about $6, which isn't that bad, but I got 15 brushes for $13. So if these brushes work well, but yeah, I'm really excited for this one. And then I'm just going to quickly run through all the, the rest because it's a lot this one is another one that i'm really excited to use look at how tiny this is i don't know if you can see that but it's the jessup 237 detail shader it's so small like this i feel would be perfect to go underneath that lower lash line or even just pack some shadow on my lid like this is so cute and adorable i love it let me see another one that's the pencil brush i remember seeing a pencil brush in here i got a pencil brush and they're really soft they feel they don't feel stiff or hard like many of those like cheap brushes you would think feel like these feel really good like quality brushes and then these are synthetic i got one two three four that are synthetic that i would like this one i would probably blend my concealer out with this looks like a really good concealer brush and then this one uh I don't know honestly but yeah these are my synthetic brushes this one looks great to like go in your lower lash line like it just fits perfectly i bought these and i was like eh, i don't know if i'm really gonna like them um when they come in let me just buy them see if i like them but but so far like they don't feel cheap i really i'm really liking like my first impressions on these brushes of course i am gonna test them out um don't just take my word because of this video but after like my few first thoughts i'll let you guys know if they're really working and i probably might do a video comparing like some brushes on one side of my face with the jessup brushes or the other brush set that i got maybe maybe that's a good idea let me know if you guys want to see that and then the last brush set that i got is this one this didn't have like a brand name they were just like random brushes i mainly got them because they were two dollars and it brought one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve twelve brushes for i think it was like 230 237 so like i was in my head i was like something with really good quality wouldn't really it wouldn't really be that cheap there has to be like something wrong with them or i don't know but i just got them because i was like eh, eh. what i would say about these brushes is that they are synthetic so unlike the jessa brushes these you can tell they're made with some type of like goat hair or hair these are synthetic for the most part like this so i wouldn't really see myself reaching for these type of brushes uh just to blend out eyeshadow uh i did get this one that i really like just because it's tiny and it's a flat shader brush again synthetic but i would use this like to press glitter onto my lid and pigments this is would be a really good brush and then i got this cute little angle brush as well and this teeny tiny pencil brush let me see if you can see that teeny tiny pencil brush overall i don't i don't know if i would use the brushes these brushes like like i think i would use the jessa brushes i got this like precise little blender that i might use but i don't know the fact that they're synthetic they're like synthetic blending brushes kind of throws me off but because i thought they were going to be fluffy like goat hair brushes but i'll try them out like i'm not gonna like bash them right away for 230, I would say try them out. Like it's it's not really gonna hurt you. If you had to choose overall brush set just to see to start off with, if you're starting out with makeup, I would say pick the Jessup brushes because they're really comparable to I would say Morphe. They're really comparable to Morphe. 
and I know because I have some of their brushes. Um, I feel like this is gonna be like a short little video, but I just really wanted to let you guys know that these brushes are out there. I wanted to basically show you guys the brushes that I got, and yeah, I will be using them in my future tutorials. I am thinking about doing a chit chat, get ready with me. To kind of show you guys how the brushes function i also did get a lot of uh not a lot but a few little makeup items here and there so i want to try those out too i would really recommend the jessup brushes though they are really i mean you see them in my videos already so i don't really have much to say about that but yeah i think that's all i have for today i really hope this video it doesn't seem pointless but i just wanted to let you guys know that they're out there like I said, everything, all the links will be listed down below in the description box, so go check that out. Um, also, if you guys want to see any type of videos, let me know. That'll really help me out a lot. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.